stories in this book are inspired by my family history, um, and a lot of them are inspired by my family's involvement in the Communist Party in the U.S. And with those stories, most of the characters are are pretty idealistic and really kind of believe in what they're doing. Um, and, and the tension in a lot of these stories is, is how that affects the other people in their lives. Like, what is it like to spend so much time trying to fix the entire world that you completely lose sight of the people closest to you? And once I had worked on some of those stories, it became really interesting for me to think about writing another story that would also be set during that time in the U.S., but by someone who didn't genuinely care about those politics. So, um, you know, as, as Fanny was reading in the story, Alexi is an out-of-work actor who can't get any parts and is really trying to charm his way into a part with this very left-wing and um, communist-sympathizing film director. Uh, and so he basically fabricates these politics, pretends to care about something that, is, that he doesn't care about for careerist reasons, um, only to end up being blacklisted and jailed for these fabricated politics and it basically destroys Catherine and Benny's life. And so I was really interested in thinking about the different ways that people would approach the same cause, whether it's coming from ego or it's coming from a place of, of you know, of, of genuine dedication to it. So it is hard to look at you. <laughs> <laughs>